What's up guys, the Coatolic is here and welcome to my channel. On this channel I do coding tutorials and challenges as well as some tips, tricks and advices. So if you're new to my channel and that sounds interesting to you, make sure you hit the bell notification button and the subscribe button. Or first the subscribe and the bell notification button. In this video, I'm going to give you 10 different ways how to make money as a developer. These ways are absolutely different from each other and they can become different sources of income for you. And you can apply multiple, many of these sources uh, at the same time. Okay, let's immediately jump into the video. And the very first one is very obvious. I'm not going to talk much about it. It's job. So you get the full-time job or part-time job, you get the salary, you have the income, that's it. The number two is also kind of similar to you. It's a freelancing. You have probably tried it. There are out there many freelancing websites like Upwork, Freelancer.com, TopTal and many others. You can just register on these websites, try freelancing. At the beginning, it's very hard to earn some money, but after some time, when you have good reputation, when you have good uh, like history of clients, then it's very easy. And sometimes freelancers, good freelancers are making much more money than the full time developers on a work. You can even start freelancing on your local area in your like in your town, in your in your city or whatever is this. So that's also like kind of very common for beginners. And yeah, this is this is the second. Number third is to start a YouTube channel. But I'm going to highlight right here that if you just start YouTube channel for sake of money, it will be very hard. So you need to start YouTube channel because uh, you just want to teach something. So for example, I started my YouTube channel two years ago and my only purpose at the time was to share my knowledge and to teach someone something. So I love teaching and this is the main purpose even right now. So um, yeah, you, you should never start your YouTube channel to make money, but if you're good in your teachings, if you have good teaching skills, if you have, if you are good in talking, then you can definitely get subscribers, get views, and thus you can get from several hundreds up to several thousands per month just from YouTube ads. I'm talking about only YouTube ads, okay? The number four is uh, teaching and tutoring um, as one-to-one -one or one-to-many physically. So I have tried this before here locally in my in my city and this uh, people are willing to pay quite a lot of money for a good people, for a person who will uh, explain them whatever they need, who will teach them something. So I know many people who are applying YouTube, uh, who are basically, uh, who have both sources of income like YouTube and tutoring. So they have quite popular YouTube channels and they are promoting their YouTube channel on Twitter and saying that, hey, I can teach you one to one if you pay this amount of money. And there are a lot of people who, who just want to pay money to uh, learn something, right? So you can, uh, th this source of income can become quite like it can take quite good percentage of your total income. The number five is create online courses. These three are kind of similar to each other and connected, like doing YouTube channel, meanwhile tutoring something physically or online, and at the same time also create online courses. But creating online courses can be very challenging and much difficult than making videos. So I'm talking from my experience. So it's uh, like creating one video takes one day, two days sometimes for me, even more uh, depending on the video. But creating an online course is like a whole absolutely different level because you have to have a very good plan. You have to be very consistent and all your videos in the course should be equally good. Okay, so that's the challenging part for me because I'm full-time developer. I can't find enough time uh, to make a course uh, and th that's the thing. Uh, but for many developers who started YouTube channel and then started online courses or who have generally online courses, this this uh, online courses source becomes the number one incoming source for them and they are making several, um, I don't know, definitely several thousands per month, maybe even more than 10,000, I don't know exactly. But this can become the biggest incoming source for you. If you are not that good in talking, but you love explaining things and you can express your knowledge, 
probably you should start uh, thinking about the number six way which is vlogging and not the vlogging sorry logging creating articles and you can create articles on um, medium even and earn money out of this so if you just create an article and uh, just publish it to the verified publishers i think you can i'm sure that you can make money from this i know people uh, who are actually making money just from medium okay from several hundred again up to several thousand depending on how good you are but you can of course create your own blog website you're a developer you know how to do this and you can write articles there and just put the adsense so many people think that adsense is like outdated but if your website has good amount of traffic you can definitely make a um, good amount of money out of this okay the number seven is to create some kind of website and get the traffic and put the ads so if you don't like explaining things if you don't want to talk if you don't want to write articles you can just create some game some online conversion tool for example which converts from pdf into word for example i don't know and just promote the website and put the ads on your website right so if the your website has several thousands views per day you definitely get some money out of the ads right so it's logical and this this can also give you quite good amount of money the number eight is to create some plugin template or whatever it will be and sell it on the online markets so there exist a lot of online markets for example theme forest and vato market which is the probably the biggest one at the moment and um, you can basically sell any kind of things what you have in your idea so it might be admin templates website templates it might be some plugins for wordpress i don't know anything so if you have something prepare it and sell it on the online markets and this can definitely become a good source of your income okay so if for example you create something but it was not uh, like posted on the online market which happened to me actually many years ago i created i wanted to sell something on the online market but it was not it was actually rejected actually it was six years ago my maybe my skills wasn't that good at the time and it was rejected from the online market because of like not good quality as, as they said but i offered this as a free as an open source thing uh to my to the whole community uh, that was the admin template and many people started using this and using this approach basically you can have donation or patreon uh, because you're offering something to the community and they are they they will definitely donate for you uh, if you if it's something worthy uh, okay so this is something you consider so donation and patreon can become also um, your like source of income uh, and also this way can give you new clients which happened to me so whenever i offer this uh, as an open source then client from usa contacted to me told me that it was they they very liked it and they wanted to use it in their system and if i would like to just work on this and implement this in their system of course i agreed and i, I was working on the on my own admin template and they were they just paid for me so that can give you uh, like creating something open source that can give you different ways of income okay it can be donation or patreon it can give you new clients clients which means freelancing and it can also give you some new other ways and the number 10 is affiliate marketing so if you have youtube channel if you have blog and write articles if you have something open source you can put the affiliate links right there okay and uh using this way basically you can promote your uh, laptop for example your camera your lightning anything basically you are using on your youtube channel as a developer or if you just write an article the cheapest laptops for programmers you can promote the laptops of course and uh, using affiliate marketing you can make definitely several hundreds or several thousands per month okay you can find all the ways in the video description the 10 different ways how to make money and you can think how to combine multiple to each other so for example creating youtube videos as well as teaching one-to-one -one, create online courses and you can connect even affiliate marketing and patreon just on your youtube channel and 
boom you have five different sources from the youtube channel okay so just youtube ads teaching and tutoring creating online courses affiliate marketing patreon donation meanwhile if you are just creating some project on your for your youtube channel you can for example sell sell it on envato or any other online market right so you can definitely use multiple ways and have multiple sources of income and if you are good if you're if you are a hard-working person you can definitely reach uh totally up to 10,000 or even more in your total income. So good luck. If you like the video, hit the like button and share this video. And this will help me a lot to grow. If you're new to my channel, hit the subscribe and the bell notification button. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.